The Scottish Ballers National Handicap Chase is up next. Race 11, the penultimate of day one here. Week six, it's a four mile monster, 0 to 130. So, top of the pile is Zacrete, winner last week for Stu Great. Second is Name Check Hotel for Peter Hannan, El Stupo for Darren Thompson, Sunnyside Up for Paul Rhodes, Great Noise for Kevin Meanhand, Spring Jamaican Stu Gray, the Jockey Assassin for Paul Rhodes, Barbarella for David Robertson, the last suspect for Kevin Meanhand, Let Your Mind for Martin Leadham, Dun Owen Al for Darren House, Dun Owen All. Bottas for James Follis, Boredom Carl Aragon to Kiki Rosberg for James Follis, Rustic Rain for Alex Cherry, Army of Stars for Obi Wan, Master Marthas for Ponty Paul, Meserat for Obi Wan, Nearest Rich for Carl Aragon to Dell's Half for Del Hinton, Jawala Street for Doug, Latterly Pepper for Darren Howes, and Ekier for Alex Cherry, 23. All looking to improve their handicap for the upcoming Grand National, which I think is about week 12. Get to the first of 20. Successfully negotiated it. And we're being led by Ellis Rich. And a great noise. A great noise had a great battle actually last week with Zar Crete. Zar Crete just managed to turn him over and get to the second. And the Paul Moore's uh, race. Well, obviously, I know a lot about this because Zar Crete is my horse, although he's having a very strange run here. He's usually a front runner and he's towards the back, which makes me think the weight's already hurting him. We're being led by great noise with a couple of lengths to Ellis Rich, Meserat, and Last Suspect. And a further couple back to Dell's Half. And then, uh, the roads. Horses of the Jockey Assassin and Sunny Side up against the fencing outside of that is Master Marthas and Jawala Street. And a length or so back to Zell Stupo. And then a further length back to Zell Creek, Rustic Rain, Name Check Hotels there. Bottas, Latterly Pepper, the widest. Kiki Rosberg against the fence. They get to the third. Slow jump from the leader. And just towards the rear is Army of Stars. Spring Jamaica. Inside of that is Let Your Mind. Boredom. Barbarella. A great. And Dunno in all. He's just at the rear. So as they come down to the next, it's great noise that takes it. Everybody's over it. As I said, the last race there. Grand Sefton didn't lose one over the entry Grand National fences. So about two mile five furlongs, they all stood on their feet. There's plenty of, plenty of time here, there's another three miles still to go. There's great noise that leads it past the winning post of the first of two times. Ellis Rich in second, last suspect is third. Meserat is four, Dell's half five. Sunnyside up six, Jockey Assassin seven, Master Marthas is eight. We get to the fifth. Everybody's over it. Just still where the rear is done, Owen all an icky hair. So take this left turn. On a small course here. Not too sure where this is. Kelso, I think. Never been to Kelso. Not even sure where it is. I assume it's on the borders. once actually to drive tanks anyway they're over the six oh no we've finally lost one sorry it's Barbarella that's gone sci-fi chick for David Robertson's a faller there to the seventh and everybody's over it including the loose horse it's Ellis Rich that's nosed himself into the front here but we're much closer all than that probably 15 to 16 17 lengths from first to last so come to the eighth. Oh, and we've lost another one there. Lost two. Bottas has gone. I think he was brought down by the fall of Meserat. So one down for Obi Wan and James Follis. Both got two in it. So yeah, both still got a horse running. So we're down three. After nine. I'm up to the next, which is the tenth. It may well be the ninth. It is the ninth. Makes great noise. It's going to lead them into it. He's up and over. That's done well now is Zar Crete moving up uh, quietly on the fence and got himself up into a challenging position. Although he looks a little bit blocked in behind Great Noise. The outside of that is Ellis Rich, the last suspect. Get over the tenth. There was a nasty old jump by the pink there, Dell's half. He certainly uh, I wouldn't say he pecked on land and he almost uh, went into the ground. 
but it's great noise that leads us still. From Zarkri in second, our suspect Ellis Rich, these four are on their own by just a couple of lengths from Dell's half against the fence. Rose is sunny side up and the jockey assassin let your mind got into a better position. They've got Master Martha's out wide. Kiki Rosberg, Rustic Rain, Spring Jamaicans, El Stupo, Joanna Street and Boredom are still there. Name check hotel, Lashley Pepper and Army of Stars. Dunno in all. Just at the rear of steel is Ekier. Come to the eleventh. It's a little baby ditch. We don't lose anybody there. It's been taken up now by Zar Crete. Top weight here though. He isn't gonna get round with twelve stone. Oh we're losing one and it's another Alex Cherry horse. This time at the fourteen furlong mark. Been, been at the rear most of the race, Ekier gets pulled up. So we get to the twelfth, Zar Crete takes it first. The rest of them are over it. So Zartar Creek now got a couple of lengths on Great Noise. The jockey Assassin last suspect, Martha's Martha, Master Martha's, Ellis Rich. A length or so back to Sunnyside Up and Keki Rosberg against the fence. And Dell's half sell Stupo, Spring Jamaican. They come past the grandstand again, the winning post. I think the circuit to go, a mile and a half or so to travel. Seven fences to take. Because this will be number 13. Let's see if it's unlucky for anyone. We're being led by Tsar Crete. Takes it first. The rest of them are over it. So Tsar Crete. Looking for a back to back wins over four miles. Be impressive if he does it. But he's got great noise on his outside. Last suspect is third. Jockey Assassin looking ominous. Keke Rosberg against the fence. Yeah, I know that is Ellis Rich. Spring Jamaica making up a little bit, bit of ground. Master Marthas is still out wide. Pink Silks of Dell's half against the fence. They get to the 14th. Everybody's over it. Star Creek was a little bit slow. Towards the rear now is Dunno in all. No, and Dunno in all is being pulled up. It's another one down. Just over a mile to travel. They take the 15th. And the five to jump. And it's Star Creek that leads us with last aspect and great noise. Towards the rear now is Name Check Hotel. We get over the 16th. Peter's Hannon's horse. Turning. Looking to knock his mark down, maybe. And the chance is uh, to be carrying 11 stone. But it's all changed up front. The last suspect, Zarkreet's been a bit slow and uh, starting to drift back a little bit now. So the last suspect's got a couple of lengths on Ellis Rich. Zarkreet being pushed along a little bit. The jockey assassin on the outside. Keki Rosberg between horses. And we've got great noise. They get to the 17th. Everybody's up and over it. And we've only got six furlongs left to travel. And it's last suspect from Ellis Rich. Zarkreet, Keki Rosberg, great noise. Master Martha's the jockey assassin. Moving through his sunny side up. They get to the 18th. There's only going to be two left to jump now. Everybody's over it. Who's going to win the Scottish Borders National Handicap? And Ellis Rich noses in front now, but on the outside is Sunny Side Up. Sunny Side Up makes hay for home. And it's Sunny Side Up that now leads. Running through well now is Borden, the Yellow Silks of Army of Stars. The ones that are going backward a little bit now are Keki Rosberg and Last Suspect. But it's Sunny Side Up that leads us by a length to Boredom. Army of Stars is third. Keki Rosberg to by the fence. On the outside of that is Rustic Rain. But it's Sunny Side Up being challenged now by Boredom. These two are one and two, but Army of Stars trying to run on. Third is Rustic Rain, Keki Rosberg out wide is the Jockey Assassin. I'm not sure anything else is going to get into this. They get to the 19th, the penultimate, but everybody's over it, and it's Sunny Side Up that leads. But now Army of Stars is the one trying to track him down on the wide outside is the Jockey Assassin, but it's Sunny Side Up inside the two furlongs. Sunny Side Up from Army of Stars, the Jockey Assassin is all getting a bit of a slog now. I'm not sure they're going to catch Sunny Side Up. He's going to get to the last, get over it. He took it early, but he did manage to get away with it, as does the remainder. And it's definitely sunny side up. It's leading. He's going to take this We're inside the final fell, and no one's going to catch this one. Sunny side up wins. Mario Stars in second. I'm running on well with Zil Stupo. But it's sunny side up. Army of Stars, maybe Keki Rosberg. Army of Stars from Keki Rosberg. I think Jockey Assassin was fourth. Zil Stupo fifth. And there's just Dell's half of the rear, the last one to come home. So sunny side up, Paul Rhodes takes it. Well done, Army of Stars. Roby one was second, third was Keki Rosberg for James Follis, fourth was Jockey Assassin for Paul Rhodes, and Zell Stupo for Darren Thompson got up for fifth.